Hi everybody, it is Sunday, March the 3rd, 2024. It's 3-3, the third day of the third month. 3-3. 3-3. And this is the lineup. This is uh, the lineup of getting AJ moved in. He's next door telling goodbye to our neighbor. So I better put, th these are his glass case. I better put it where he knows where it's at. He's, he has a bad habit of not wanting to put his glasses in a glass case. He's got a really, really bad habit of that. He just wants to throw his glasses off at night and not put it in his glass case. Well, somehow we've got to fit all this stuff into the truck. And uh, this is what's going with AJ. We got bags for towels and bags. Uh, we got clothes and schoolwork and um, towels and toiletries and washcloths. This is actually worse than 4-H camp packing. So, um, yeah, he's, he's going to be gone for about three weeks, roughly, two, at least two, maybe three weeks. And so now I'm used to packing um, for like a week, I guess, for a 4-H camp. But uh, no, uh, he's got to have his uh, gaming pillow. He likes that. So we've got all kinds of things ready to go for AJ and he was telling everybody at church this morning that uh, he was leaving out so he made the announcement at church and Stephen stood up in church this morning and told everybody that this was the day that he was leaving out so he is you know wanted to reassure everybody that he is doing homeschooling work and we have that going so it's not like he's not going to get an education. But it's like um, in the mid-60s today, and it's beautiful, and the sun is out. And it's nice not to have to be hot. I mean, uh, have a coat on. and a. It's nice to be warm. It's nice not to be cold is what I'm trying to say. So my men are leaving out today. All right, so you want me to start handing you bags then? Yeah. All right, so I'm going to start. We're pack hey, Jay doesn't know we're packing him up. Uh, now, he doesn't have a uh, rod yet for his clothes. Steven's going to work on getting a rod for his clothes. The biggest stuff first. All right. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. There's one bag. All right. Here's bag number two. This is ha this has his underwear and socks and in there. That's his sock and underwear bag. Bag number three. This has towels. And wash rigs. That's towels and wash rigs. Oh yeah, yeah. The, here, let me show. Them. Okay, it says white hydraulics on there. That's a uh, my dad used to work there. All right. Then this has school books in it. And his pillow <laughs> that has his school stuff some of his school stuff okay that um, that's more school stuff no nope, almost okay here's his all his gaming stuff his he has to travel with his games that's his gaming stuff. Here's a hamper and a laundry bag. I'm not sure how Steven's going to work that out. Well, there's no more room for AJ. <laughs> Alright, got to pack his jacket. And then here's hot chocolate and marshmallows in his drinking cup. Um, packing him his hot chocolate 
and marshmallows and drinking cup. And then his toothpaste bag. And look at that. It actually says Elite Transportation on it. So, see, look. Elite Transportation. Elite Transportation. Look at that. He's got his own little shower bag with the company's name on it that we... That's it. So you'll have to figure out how to make that work. Steven says there's no more room for AJ. <laughs> all right, so Steven is up there packing all of AJ's well, that's stuff. That's it. Two bags, Chris. That was it. Don't know where the rest is going. <laughs> Only two bags fit up there. Well, we're getting him settled in. He's, uh, like I said, he's next door uh, talking to my neighbor who is his substitute grandma. She's been his grandma, a uh, grandma figure his whole life. So, he's over there talking to her. Last night was his last night to spend the night with the cats. Yeah, they don't have no more room. Well, then mom went over <laughs> That's mandatory. Should have seen when we went to California. Oh yeah, when we went to California. I needed a semi to haul the crap she put in the Cadillac. I got five miles less than a gallon when it hauled so much crap. Steven. There you go. So I had to keep this closed. Keep all that junk from falling when it hit the bricks. Do you see, does he have room to sleep, sleep up there now? No. There, I told you there's no more room for AJ. See, there's AJ's stuff, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Tell me the mom didn't overpack. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, oh my God. Well, I mean, okay, so. so uh, focus out so they can see. Go to the last one. You'll have there's to AJ's junk. Mom packed him up. Now there's no room for AJ. <laughs> Well, but you tell it, tell it, remind everybody about your plans up here. Uh, I'm not going to remind them. There's going to be netting across the top where he can put his computer and small stuff. We can also get some stuff under the bunk here. Yeah. Not heavy stuff though. And so, but we definitely don't have room for all that stuff. That's mom overpacking. Well, it's his first time out. And I guess it's, you know, uh, better to be safe. And Mike, it is super duper hot in here when the sun's barreling down on that truck. So, like you said, he'll probably hate me for it because he'll feel like he's in hail. <laughs> you can get like a little personal fan, can't you? No. You're like, you can get like a little fan up there, right? No. Oh, yeah, you're sweating. It's hot up there. Get up there and find out. Well, that's what Mike Taylor said. He said that uh, it was really hot traveling um, in, the, in the truck. Yep, big brother said it was going to be hot. Knew he was going to hate his dad. That's why well, he already hates his dad. So, down if you do, and down if you don't. But there are like little mini fans, right? You can get like a little personal fan blowing up there. Her mama I'm gonna worry. Already ain't made it out the door. <laughs> now I gotta get my gear in here. Yeah. Aren't you excited? This is gonna be a Sure, I'm excited. <laughs> I moved in a boy and I have to, I, I don't know who's gonna drive the truck because there's no place for my stuff to go. <laughs> When you get a Harley Davidson, ladies and gentlemen, 
You get a tag that says Harley, which is up there. You get a little pin that says Harley Davidson. And you get a little bell. Don't forget to ring that bell. God bless. Have a wonderful day. Have lots of fun. Don't forget to take your son to work. And later.